and here we are, aliens. Earth, right before your very eyes. Ooh. Ah. Now remember, don't get into too much trouble. And remember, act like humans. Wait, what's a human again? Remember, Maggie, it's those weird creatures that live on Earth? Oh, okay. Well, now that we're here, what are we supposed to do? Yeah, wait. We don't know much about these humans, so how are we supposed to blend in? Um, let's see. Maybe we could ask that human over there? Hello, fellow human. I was wondering, what are you doing here all alone? Haven't you heard? We're in COVID times. Ah, yes, the human thing. You guys aren't from here, are you? Nope. You caught us. We're aliens. Upashna, the first thing we learned in school is not to tell humans that we're aliens. Wait, I don't see what was wrong with what she did. Calm down, you guys. I'm just trying to get some help. Well, little human thing, would you like to teach us the ways of being human? I guess that doesn't seem too bad. It sounds a lot better than what I had planned. And what did you have planned? Nothing. Like I said, we're in COVID times, so there's not that much to do. Okay, human. We should get started now. Ooh, starting things is fun. I never seem to finish them, though. First lesson, don't call humans humans. Second lesson, our morning routine. And third lesson of the day, I'll bring you guys back to my house to show you what it's like to get ready in the morning. Okay, here we are. Who's ready to start our morning routine? Morning routine, hmm, okay. What do we do? Well, I like to start with brushing my teeth first. Brushing your teeth? What even is that? The only thing I like to do with my teeth is eat snacks. Yeah, we can tell, Maggie. So human. What is this brushing? Okay, Aileen, so I'm gonna teach you how to brush your teeth. First, you take your toothpaste, then you take your toothbrush, and you apply the toothpaste onto the toothbrush, like so, and you start brushing. And then your teeth you spit it out, and your teeth are nice and white. Wow. I mean, it looks easy enough. Let me try. <laughs> no, Hashna, you're supposed to do it like this. Wait, you guys, I think I got it. <laughs> um... You know what? I think we should probably try something else. Hey guys, what are you doing in here? I don't know how you humans live. I don't think I can survive this quarantine any much longer. Seriously? It's maybe been like 10 minutes. It's been years. What on earth is there to do to pass the time? Well, we could play a game. No one wants to play a game. What does that even mean? A game? Well, the thing is, it's kind of hard to explain. I guess it's just something people do when they hang out. Here, let me show you. Here, let's play one of my favorite games, Candyland. Candyland? What the heck is a Candyland? I would play, but I don't want to sit next to this for for your information, Clara, it's Chloe, not Mr. Smelly. <sighs> Come on, guys. Can we just all get along and play the game and have a good time? Okay, fine. Okay, so here's what the directions say. We each pick a color piece that we want. We each take turns rolling the dice, move around the board, and the first one to reach the candy castle at the end wins and... Are you done yet? Can we just get on with the game already? Well, let's start. I call the pink piece. What? No way. I want it. Give it to me right now. I already called it. Guys, can we please stop fighting? Everybody, 
Say this with me. You get what you get, and you don't throw a fit. Okay, now that we're all good, it seems, let's get back to the game. Welp, it looks like Clara, you landed on the space that says, move back three spaces. What a bummer. Away, kid. I want to reach Candyland first. I'm going to roll again. Clara, that's not how the game even works. You have to listen to the rules and abide by them to play the game correctly. Ooh, Clara's going to lose. No, this game is rigged. Aliens, that's enough. Here on Earth, we learn to forgive each other and treat others the way we want to be treated. Ugh, why is it so hard to be human? Can we play a new game now? Okay, sure. Why don't we play hide and seek? So, we're gonna have one person in who closes their eyes for 60 seconds, and then the other people go hide, and the seeker tries to go find them. Who wants to be it? How about we go with Upashna? Ha! In your faces! Nyeh, 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 nyeh. Okay, let's all go hide, and Upashna, you start counting out loud to 60 seconds. One, two, three, fifty-nine, sixty. Ready or not, here I come. <laughs> Found you, Chloe. If I can't see you, you can't see me. Chloe, that's not how the game works. Fine, you found me. Kayla, holding something over your head does not mean you're hidden. Oh, man. Maggie, you know I can see you, right? You're basically not even hiding. I tried my hardest, and Clara took my spot before I could get to it. Clara is not in a good spot either. See? Hey, that's not fair. You guys, what did I say about fighting? Sorry. Okay, guys, let's just let's just go eat now. Okay, so what kind of food do you guys like? Dinosaur nuggets, peanut butter and jellies. Wait, you guys have dinosaurs here? That's like my favorite food back on our planet. Dinosaur, dinosaur, dinosaur. Wait, one second. You guys don't mean actual dinosaur nuggets, do you? Of course we mean actual dinosaurs. What else would dinosaurs nuggets be? Um, I guess chicken. You know, we don't actually have dinosaurs here anymore on Earth. Well, well, at least not anymore. Because you ate them all? No, not at all. <laughs> Maybe we should just stick to peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. Okay, here we are with some premium peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Oh, this looks yummy. What is this? Why don't you guys just try it? It's better than it looks. I promise. Pinky promise. Ah! Wait, is everything okay? Is something wrong? See, this is why it's important to try new things. If you would have never eaten the peanut butter and jelly sandwiches, you would have never known how good they are. Hey, he's right. But all that food made me really tired. So this is where we sleep at night. Um, where are the sleeping pods? Sleeping pods? What are those? You know, it's where we sleep and get energy and stuff. Obviously, they don't sleep in sleeping pods. They must sleep in whatever this weird, cushy thing is. <laughs> it's so bouncy! It's like being in zero gravity, even though there is gravity. That's my bed. Here on Earth, that's where we sleep. Bed. That's a funny word. Bed. 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 Bed! <laughs> well, who gets to sleep in the bed? Well, actually, before we decide that, we have to do our nighttime routine. Another routine? 
Of course, another routine. Humans seem to love doing things in order. Oh, human. I mean, Alden. What is the routine? Well, the first thing we do is brush our teeth. I taught you guys that earlier, so you guys should be pros at it now. Okay, guys, now everyone get their toothbrushes and brush their teeth. Ooh, what's next? I hope it's as easy as brushing our teeth. Maggie, it took us all morning to learn how to brush our teeth. All right, aliens, now it's time for bed. Good morning, aliens. Morning already? All right, aliens. I think it's time we head back home. Aw, but it was just starting to get fun around here. Chloe's right. We can't stay here forever. Having you guys here was so much fun. I'm really gonna miss you all. I'm gonna miss you too. But at least we'll have all the memories of all the cool human food we got us. That's right. You guys should each go around saying one thing that you learned that you're going to take back on your planet. I never thought I'd be able to spend so much time with you guys. The games were actually really fun. Yeah, I know. And those peanut butter jelly sandwiches were so yummy. And I learned that beds are squishy and that we don't eat dinos here. Maggie. And today, I learned the importance of patience in, well, about everything. So thank you, Alden. You're a great human. Aw, thanks, guys. Quarantine's been really hard, but having you all here has made it 10 times better. And also, I really hope you guys have a safe trip back home, whatever planet you're on. And also, I hope I can see you again sometime.